Most ancient Egyptians were farmers tied to the land. Their dwellings were restricted to immediate family members and were constructed of mud brick designed to remain cool in the heat of the day. Each home had a kitchen with an open roof, which contained a grindstone for milling grain and a small oven for baking the bread. Ceramics served as household wares for the storage, preparation, transport, and consumption of food, drink, and raw materials. Walls were painted white and could be covered with dyed linen wall hangings. Floors were covered with reed mats, while wooden stools, beds raised from the floor and individual tables comprised the furniture. The ancient Egyptians placed a great value on hygiene and appearance. Most bathed in the Nile and used a pasty soap made from animal fat and chalk. Men shaved their entire bodies for cleanliness. Perfumes and aromatic ointments covered bad odors and soothed skin. Clothing was made from simple linen sheets that were bleached white. And both men and women of the upper classes wore wigs, jewelry, and cosmetics. Children went without clothing until maturity. At about age 12. And at this age males were circumcised and had their heads shaved. Mothers were responsible for taking care of the children, while the father provided the family's income. Music and dance were popular entertainments for those who could afford them. Early instruments included flutes and harps, while instruments similar to trumpets, oboes, and pipes developed later and became popular. In the New Kingdom, the Egyptians played on bells, cymbals, tambourines, drums, and imported lutes and lyres from Asia. The sistrum was a rattle-like musical instrument that was especially important in religious ceremonies. Quote, the ancient Egyptians enjoyed a variety of leisure activities, including games and music. Sonnet, a board game where pieces moved according to random chance was particularly popular from the earliest times. Another similar game was Mayan, which had a circular gaming board. Hounds and Jackals, also known as 58 Holes is another example of board games played in ancient Egypt. The first complete set of this game was discovered from a Theban tomb of the Egyptian pharaoh. Amenemhat IV that dates to the 13th dynasty. Juggling and ball games were popular with children. And wrestling is also documented in a tomb at Beni Hassan. The wealthy members of ancient Egyptian society enjoyed hunting, fishing, and boating as well. The excavation of the workers' village of Deir el Medina has resulted in one of the most thoroughly documented accounts of community life in the ancient world, which spans almost 400 years. There is no comparable site in which the organization, social interactions, and working and living conditions of a community have been studied in such detail.